inspiration has lived here since 1592. And more than 400 years later, it's still going strong. Inspiration has helped burgeoning writers put pen to paper and given world leaders a head start. It has set the stage for budding playwrights and created characters that will never die. For countless actors who started here, inspiration has played a part. Work done in Trinity helped split the atom, battled cancer, and guided man's first giant leap. From here, we've inspired people around the world. But even with this proud history, we are firmly focused on the future. Today, we are making new discoveries and inspiring the next generation of history makers. Welcome to this virtual tour of Trinity College Dublin, located in the heart of Dublin city centre. Your guides on this tour will be our team of friendly and experienced global ambassadors who are all current Trinity students. They will guide you around our historic campus and share their insights into life at Trinity. My name is Ellen, I'm a Global Room Ambassador and part of my role is to take people on campus tours of Trinity. Trinity has been at the epicentre of Ireland's cultural and intellectual life since it was founded in 1592. It is the oldest university in Ireland and currently has 18,000 students. Trinity is ranked 101st in the world and is the 17th most international university in the world, with more than 27% of students coming from outside of Ireland. Some of the buildings that you can see in Front Square are the 1937 Reading Room for postgraduates, the Old Library, the Exam Hall, Regent House, the Chapel, the dining hall, and the campanile or bell tower. There is even a superstition about the bell tower. It is said that if it rings while you are standing beneath it, it is a bad omen for your impending exams. The old library dates back to the founding of Trinity in 1592, and it attracts hundreds of thousands of visitors each year. It is the largest library in Ireland, with over 6 million printed books in its collection. The most famous of its manuscripts is the Book of Kells. It is a legal deposit library and receives copies of all material published in Ireland and the UK. The library supports the learning and research needs across the college. A visit to the long room at the old library is a special experience. We are now at the Berkeley Library, one of several libraries at Trinity. You can see Arnaldo Pomodoro's Sfera con Sfera sculpture, which is affectionately nicknamed the Berkeley Globe. Trinity offers a wide range of undergraduate and postgraduate programmes across three faculties, Arts, Humanities and Social Sciences, Engineering, Maths and Science, and Health Sciences. The university has been ranked in the top 50 global universities for classics and ancient history, English language and literature, nursing and pharmacy and pharmacology, with a total of 18 subjects in the top 100. Researchers from the world-class School of Pharmacy and Pharmacology have contributed significantly to Ireland's response to the current COVID-19 situation alongside colleagues from immunology, public health and medicine. A distinctive feature of Trinity is the support offered for undergraduates by the senior tutor. The senior tutor's office pairs students with a tutor who is a member of the academic staff and acts as an advocate for you all the way through your time at the university. The Postgraduate Advisory Service offers free, independent and confidential support, guidance and advocacy to our postgraduate students. The rubrics are the oldest existing buildings in Trinity and were built around 1700 in the Georgian style. There is a similarly long history of clubs and societies at Trinity with some well-known societies such as the HIST, the Historical Society and the PHIL, the Philosophical Society, being established in 1747 and 1693 respectively. There are now 120 societies at Trinity and include a very diverse range from choral, dance, environment, film, business and several language and cultural societies. These societies attract many well-known international figures as speakers. Trinity is home to 50 sports clubs too, and you don't need to be a pro to join. All skill levels are welcome. These clubs range from rowing and rugby to soccer and snow sports. There is something for everyone, and everyone ends up finding their place. 
The playing fields often host practices and matches for the rugby and cricket teams. Trinity's cherry blossom trees line the playing fields and are a beautiful spot to stop, take a moment to enjoy the beauty of the campus and maybe snap a photo for Instagram too. The Samuel Beckett Theatre, named after one of the most innovative playwrights of the 20th century, was opened in 1992 to celebrate the quarter centenary of Trinity. During the academic year, the theatre showcases work from within the drama department and outside of term, it hosts visits from some of the most prestigious dance and theatre companies from Ireland and abroad. The Samuel Beckett Centre also houses the Players' Theatre, the Black Box Theatre of Dublin University Players, Trinity's Student Drama Society, which puts on dozens of student productions every year. Celebrating cultural diversity at Trinity, the Global Room is a social space for all students with an international outlook. Global Room staff and student ambassadors are readily available to assist with advice, locating student services, adjusting to life in Ireland, and advising on immigration queries. The Global Ambassadors host the Unique to Dublin program at the start of the academic year, aimed at undergraduates, and a Getting to Grips program, aimed at postgraduate students as well. It also houses the International Student Support Hub and is an event venue for all Trinity students where we host celebrations of national holidays, film screenings, society events and talks. Trinity offers several accommodation options. Rooms overall tend to be single bedrooms with ensuite bathrooms, with the kitchen and living room shared with flatmates. Trinity Hall is the first-year undergraduate student residence located in nearby Dartry, which is about two miles from the main campus. Cavanaugh Court in the city centre is another option and is open to applicants from postgraduate and undergraduate students from all years. All Trinity's accommodation is well served by public transport links or within walking distance from the main teaching locations. Living in the city means that there is a wealth of amenities on the student's doorstep. We are now at the Walton Sculpture. Ernest Walton, who was once an undergrad in Trinity, and later a lecturer and then head of the School of Physics in the 1940s, experimentally confirmed Einstein's famous equation E equals mc squared. He also won the Nobel Prize for his work. At this point we want to tell you about the extensive range of student services that Trinity offers. S2S is a peer support service where a student one year ahead from the same course mentors a new student. There is also student learning development to help develop your academic skills. The counseling service offer a range of supports including individual and group counseling sessions. Extensive supports are also offered by our health service and our careers advisory service. There are also a range of student-led supports offered through the Students' Union and the Graduate Students' Union. Sport plays an important role in a well-rounded university education, and Trinity has a full range of sports facilities on and off campus. As a registered student, you'll have access to the state-of-the-art sports centre, including a fitness theatre, which has a full range of cardiovascular and weight stations, a 25 meter swimming pool, an 11 meter high climbing wall, fitness studios and more. There is also a full schedule of fitness classes with personal trainers and physiotherapists available, all for a reduced student fee. The new Trinity Business School was officially opened in May 2019. Its smart classrooms have the latest digital technology. Unique features of this near zero energy building include a living wall on Pier Street, which has seven different species of plants, which also provide a habitat for nature. Sustainability is a key aspect of the new building. The building is also home to form Trinity's newest cafe, a great gathering spot on campus. Art and science merge at Trinity Science Gallery, a venue for ideas. Science Gallery hosts multidisciplinary exhibitions open to the public throughout the year and is one of Dublin's most unique attractions. It also allows students the opportunity to work part-time as mediators, engaging visitors and demonstrating experiments. Since its opening, more than 3 million visitors to this non-profit gallery have experienced exhibitions ranging from contagion and biomimicry to the future of the human species. The focus is on providing programmes and experiences that allow visitors to participate and facilitate social connections. Trinity also has state-of-the-art teaching, learning and research facilities that are separate from the main campus. The Trinity Biomedical Sciences Institute, TBSI, located on Pierce Street, 
is an environment where innovative and interdisciplinary approaches lead to important scientific discoveries. Students of medicine, immunology, pharmacy, biochemistry and related degree programmes will spend the most time here. Trinity has two main teaching hospitals for our health science students, Tala Hospital and St James's Hospital. Our School of Nursing and Midwifery is a two minute walk from the main campus. Students pursuing degrees in acting, theatre and stage management are based at the Lear, Ireland's National Academy of Dramatic Arts, located at Grand Canal Quay. The Lear often opens its doors to the public and offers a programme of performances, films, play readings, talks and lectures. Thank you for joining the Global Ambassadors for this virtual tour of Trinity College Dublin. We hope that you've enjoyed this glimpse of life at Trinity and that someday we will be able to welcome you to our beautiful campus in person. Gurra thank you.